What's up everyone? So today we're taking a look at the all new rigid 14 gallon 6.0 peak HP NXT wet dry vacuum. The model number for this HD1400. I'll put the link in the description below. Let's get the review started. Probably the most powerful rigid vac I have used to date and I have had a lot of them. Now this comes with a bunch of different attachments. You also get the large capacity two piece drum for the heavy duty pro cleanups. Get the three layer fine dust filter captures 99.5% of all dust particulates. And you get the rigid lifetime warranty. You also get this handy little carrying kit right on the back here. It pops right on the back. All you got to do is put the wheels on or the casters, whatever you want to call them, when this thing comes up. And here's all the different attachments that you get with it. You get two different ones. You get the hose over here. Now these are the two and a half inch hoses and ones. Now Rigid did do a good job on actually allowing the accessories to be hung on the unit without having to worry about them falling off. They also added a really cool feature that I'll show you right here. Check this out. You don't have to worry about your attachments or your hoses coming off. It actually has a little locking system. All you got to do is push it on. It locks automatically if you want to take them off. You push that button and it'll come off again. So no more of these wands and these attachments falling off while you're using them. I love it. I think it's one of the coolest features on this vac. And before I forget, the hose is seven foot long. Now let's take a look at the filter here. This is the VF6000. It's the wet debris and dry debris filter. I really like how you put these in and take them out. You don't have to worry about that old nut that you had to put in there. You just pull it out, you pop it back in, and that's it. So let me show you the inside of the vac itself. Extra heavy duty, just like all of the other rigid vacs out there on the market. You know, this really does take in a lot of water, a lot of debris. How powerful is it? Let me show you what I did the other day. I really wanted to put this thing to the test, so I took it up to the North Atlantic just to see if we could find anything down that way. We put it on the blower attachment and the suck attachment. Check this out. No issues here. Blowing the ocean across the floor. We finally come across something we thought was pretty cool, so we just kept pulling that water in. You can see, took it right off of whatever this was. No problem. Let's see if we can get a little bit more. Uh, is, is that the Titanic? So there you go, pretty impressive. Now let's show you what it actually does around the house here. We're gonna latch it just like so. You got one on each side. Let's check out some leaves here. Believe it or not, this really is not that loud at all. I also have the two wands connected. Don't have to worry about those coming off. It don't have to bend down either. Let's show you how it blows this stuff off. Now you got a 20 foot extension cord on this and you have the swivel wheels that allow this to rotate 360 degrees. Got some more leaves here, we'll blow those out. Allows you to get in those tight corners with those wands there. And just to show you what this would do in the shop area, got all these leaves all over the place. Turn it on, got a nice little push to it. All right, now we're in here, we got the smaller attachment on there. We're just picking up those leaves. If I were to take that smaller attachment off, it would just take those and suck them right in, but extremely powerful. Check this out. We'll just take those and pull them right up in. I had a shirt laying on my table the other day. I was using this and accidentally pulled it right in too. Now the amperage on this 10.5. The air volume on it 165 CFM. Product weight on it 26.6 pounds. The voltage 120 again 14 gallons. Took the filter out. We're going to pull this water up into whirl barrels. It's been sitting there for a while. Let's check it out. We'll turn it on. You can see how deep it is. Right to about here or so. We're looking at about 30 gallons. Let's turn it on. We're not going to pull it all up at the same time, but I'll show you how fast this actually pulls it up and how powerful it is. All right, so right there we reached our gallon capacity. We're going to take this out. What it does is it actually shuts it down. It has like a little blocker in there. It comes up through. 
and prevents that air from coming in. We'll empty that out using the drain right here. We're just gonna loosen it up. We'll let it drain out. We're ready to go again. So real convenient. Now, of course, I have this on high speed, so it doesn't really come out that quick, but it does drain fairly quickly. And once we finish this up, we will go and take the rest of it out. We'll put the smaller attachment on there and we'll let you see how it pulls up in those tighter areas. So again, you can get into those tighter areas. You don't have to worry about, you know, not having enough attachments because they do give you all the attachments. Really is a powerful unit. Very impressed with it. Now, you do got a handle on this. I will tell you this, I'm not impressed with the way the cord wrap is. It just doesn't have enough room. For some reason, Rigid always kind of struggled, in my opinion, with the hose wraps or the cord wraps. You know, my last unit, I thought it was a little bit better, was on the side. This right here, I'm not a fan of. Here's the top view. I mean, it does do the job, but again, it's just kind of ugly, and I don't think they've ever gotten it right when it comes to the cord wraps. All right, so you also have the attachments here. You can put the wand on each side. You got that storage area in the back to put your attachments so you don't have to worry about putting those down somewhere and not being able to find them. Real easy and convenient to do that. All in all, this is a really tough vac. Anytime you go out onto a construction site or around somebody's house, wherever you're at, you always see the orange backs just because they're built so well. It's probably one of the best things that Rigid actually comes out with. I love the on and off button. You don't have that little switch. You actually have a bigger one right there. You can push it, turn it on, push it again, shut it off real quick, real simple, and easy to get to. Now again, when you get this home, you will have to do a little bit of assembly. You're gonna have to put those casters on. You're gonna have to put those attachments on, but it's not gonna take you any more than about five minutes to get those done. You're gonna get the two-piece heavy-duty drum construction. That offers a tougher and more durable vacuum. And at the end of the day, it's probably going to last you a very long time, just like all of my other vacs. If you like this video, thumbs up, subscribe. Check us out at toolreviewzone.com, and we will be back with more videos soon.